Got my looks from my dad and my brains from my mama. Good morning, y'all. It's another beautiful day. So, if you remember, in two videos ago, about my, my what is your why video, I talked about mom and my dad and us sharing our eggs with them uh, to, so that make sure that they have better stuff to eat. Whenever you tell my dad he's old and setting his ways, he, he's gonna try to prove you wrong. So, really my mom convinced him that she wanted some chickens. <laughs> and what better place to get chickens from than your son. So we're gonna keep Zoe's chickens, the Rhode Island Reds. There is one that is a rooster. So my dad's gonna take the rooster. I'm gonna have to strap that down. But we're gonna give him some of our younger golden comets. I believe that's what they are. The ones that I got from my friend months ago, they're almost to laying age. So we're gonna basically trade out. So you know we've been using the chicken tractor for a while now. <clears throat> it's worked great. I've been moving it. Um, but it's just, I don't know, it's inconvenient because of how heavy it is for me to try to move it as often as I want to. So, I'm actually going to, we're gonna get the Rhode Island Reds out of here. chase a couple around right then so I'm gonna move this out to my dad's house so that the golden comments that we're gonna give him this will be their pen up here just be stationary and he's gonna build a fence <laughs> and then eventually he's gonna build a coop and then I'll get this back and I'll figure I'll do something else with it so we're gonna move these into the chicken pit the chicken pen and lock them up in the, the coop right now so that I can catch. I'll have Chastity and Zoe come out and tell me which which golden comments they want to get rid of. Check out this tree. Look at that. I think a woodpecker got a hold of it. It's kind of cool to see one that deep it's falling over too. I need to get it out of the way. So we're gonna take off the water. He said uh, he's just gonna use those other types of water things, which is fine. So I'm gonna take this off for him. I kind of need to work on the little setup, anyways. He used the wrong, wrong hookup. Yeah, it's, just, it's just not right.
Whew. Like I said, that thing is heavy. It's worked great um, <clears throat> for temporary use. I definitely want to make a lighter one for whenever we do um, meat birds or if we even decide to do a chicken tractor again. I'm not real positive because I was over at Reach Refuge looking at how they had their meat birds and kind of how Justin Rhodes has his and I might do something similar to that. Just build, build the, the shelter and have the fence around them, move them similar to that way. Especially since we kind of want to do a good bit. We might even um, kind of combine with a, a couple friend of ours and do a, a do a bit so that we can all kind of split them. Now, it's time to move the youngins in here. Figure out which ones Zoe and Chastity want to use or want to give them. And uh, it should be good. I hope this is a, I believe this is where he told me he wanted. All right. I don't know if you've seen them yet. This is my dad. Hey, people. So, what made you finally decide to get the chickens? Your mother. Right, my mom. We know what you're going to do with them, so we had to have them. We, get back, we had to get back into the chicken business. Yeah, because on, on, on the video where I said what my why was, and I said, if I could help them to eat healthier, then I would. And they, they felt bad. She felt bad. They know that I'm right. That's all you got to say. You're right, son. I don't think that's going to happen. But you all know. You all know. You don't know, take after me. Who do I take after? Take after my mama? Some things you take after your mother. I don't know about that. I think it's more my brother takes after her and I take well, after Well, that's, that's usually the case. Your brother takes after your mama and you took, you took after me. I take after him because my wife talks me into things. Oh, this is true. And then in order to execute the plans in which my wife comes up with, I have to then do research, get some information to do it the right way. <laughs> and that's what you do. I don't research as much as you do. Well, because I I'm got, more of a fly by night. I, I do it, when I, you know. I got the best of both. I ones. learn as I go. So I got my looks from my dad and my brains from my mama. That's what you're saying. You're right. Oh, you gotta say that. I can't say that. You're right. I can't say that. Because you're not right. <laughs> you're never right. Okay. Well, I appreciate you taking the chickens. Because it's better for y'all. Guess what kind of food he got, too? Now, he didn't just get regular chicken food. So, tell me I don't have an impact on on your decisions. You got the non-GMO, which is, which is better than just the regular stuff. I, I've got, you got to talk them into the organic. You yes, because I got that because the poor chickens, they're going to have to learn to eat what I give them. Well, well, yeah. And I got to wean them off of this. Oh, okay, yeah. I see. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> gotcha. The rooster's still in there with the Rhode Island Reds. Uh, what we're going to do is this evening, I'm going to put him in a kennel and I'll put him in with the girls. So while they are calm and stuff at night, they can all get acclimated because my dad wants the rooster. We don't want the rooster. And so that's it. I'm glad that they were able to take them and we can get it situated and kind of figure out our next step. Most important thing next is we definitely need to be working on the garden and getting the ducks in their new spot and getting the goats more, more property to roam. But appreciate you hanging out with us today and we'll catch you in the next one.